All right, next myth. Some people just aren't motivated. And if they were motivated, then they would work out. Yeah, so it's a great it's a great kind of initial thought. And I think it's a good excuse for us to give ourselves that says like, yeah, man, I'm just not motivated like you, right? And so while there are like a couple people out there that are constantly motivated, and then there's a couple people out there that are just straight like robots when it comes to how they're going to approach their fitness, it really doesn't matter about motivation. All that matters is that you figure out how to show up through the door to a program or gym that's going to actually help you with no motivation be able to proceed forward. So like the reason why most people feel like they lack motivation to do it is because their workouts are so uncomfortable that it does require a lot of like gassing yourself up for it. But a good workout, like a solid program, like our program, you don't have to be motivated. You just have to show up because the way that it's designed is that if I walk in, like I crawl out of bed, I walk into the gym and I don't feel like doing shit, doesn't matter. So much so that all that I have to do is walk through that door and the first part of the workout is going to be exercises and movements that are going to be slowly ramping up, building my tissue up, waking my joints up, getting my neural patterns firing. They're not uncomfortable. They're yeah. like not a big deal at all. It's the same reason why people don't stretch. People go, they don't stretch. Why don't they stretch? Because stretching is painful. Boring. Boring and painful. Yeah. You're like, I don't want to sit down there and be uncomfortable for that long. Yeah. Working out is the same way for most people. That's why they don't have any motivation. So mm-hmm. your program needs to be one in which has a progressive style of movement to where by the time you get to what is like considered hard stuff, you feel great. <laughs>